Hi guys. Today I will show you how to save $30. As I was changing the cabin filter, the whole glove box came off and fell to the floor. Because it was so full and heavy, it ripped the hook off that dampener behind the glove box. It is easy to replace, just slide it out and pull it out behind the glove box. Now we are here with this contraption. There is a rail with teeth on it. Here, I pointed it with my pencil. This white plastic piece is a sled that moves back and forth on the rails. Like a roller coaster. And then there is this spring that pulls the sled back into the start position. That is when the glove box is closed. And then this part is the gear box. The gears in here are very hard to rotate. The gear is running on those teeth along the tracks. When you pull on the rope, it is hard to pull. This gearbox is making it hard for the glove box door to open. When you close it, and the pressure from the door is released, then this little spring pulls the gearbox away from the teeth, and the gearbox can spin freely, and that makes it easy for the spring to pull the sled back into the zero position. That is a genius idea. No wonder they want $30 for this. I drilled a hole in here, and then I fixed that rope through the hole. You need to be careful to have the rope not touch that little wheel of fortune. That keeps the sled from moving freely on the rails. Imagine that someone got paid to design this. When you put the parts back together, you have to hold the gearbox in place within the sled. Then insert the spring into the sled as I show here. The sled inserts into the rails only from this side. Make sure you don't break off those little tabs. Now it is already assembled. When you pull on the rope, you feel the resistance of the gear box, but when you let go, it snaps back easy. Take my advice, and be careful with this rope when you replace the cabin filter. Disconnect it before you touch the glove box door. Thank me later, and I hope this will not happen to you that the little hook breaks of the sled. You all have a great day, and don't forget to sub and comment and like if you will.